Okay, what do we want to do with this People's Countryside crowdfunding campaign? Well, we want to actually, there's six of us in the team at the moment, but we want to get a team of three over to Guernsey, hopefully in September, and through live radio, filming and photography, we want to tell the story of the coastal footpath of the island, tell the personal stories of the um, commemorative benches that populate that path overlooking the sea, and then speak to people on that route who are working out in nature to, to you know, benefit nature and basically give them the opportunity to ask for the help they need to enhance their work. And that's where you come in. You will uh, be able to offer your assistance in any way possible. So this is a great platform to uh, help all those people. The team that will be going over to Guernsey is myself, Stuart the Wild Man Mabbot, presenting the show. Um, we have Ross Arrowsmith, running the camera, the filming and directing, and we'll have William Manklo doing all the photography. Basically, we've got 30 days to raise the total sum we need. And if we don't raise that sum within those 30 days, we don't get a penny. If we raise more, great, we can do more. But um, so realistically, if we say we need about 356 of you to donate 30 quid, and we will hit our target. The main benefits of this project of going over to Guernsey is we will leave a lasting legacy of photography, radio and film to showcase the state of nature over on Guernsey this year, 2017. Also, our material can be repurposed for the talking newspapers nationally, which are audio newspapers that are recorded and distributed for people with visual impairments. Our material will be aired on Jubilee Hospital Radio and other radio stations, so uh, our, our material will actually enhance the ex patient recovery and well-being while they are in hospital, so uh, that's an extra benefit. And finally, the minimum we want to achieve through photography, radio and film is we want to document the current state of nature on Guernsey for future reference. Now this nature stuff really does work because two years ago I was completely crippled with rheumatoid arthritis. I could not get out of bed, I couldn't feed myself, I couldn't move. And I discovered sensory engagement with nature helped me manage my pain and it got me walking again. So nature in many ways can enhance our lives and we've got to start looking after her uh, because uh, she is us and we are her. So uh, we need each other. So please support our crowdfunding Kickstarter campaign to get us over to Guernsey. We'll be doing more trips coming up in the future. But uh, subscribe to this uh, YouTube channel and uh, stay in touch with what we're doing.